Hello, Cancerians. Welcome to your reading. Welcome back. I'm sending you so much love and light. This is going to be a reading for Cancer and Leo. If your person has Leo in their chart, they could have a Leo moon, Venus rising. And this reading is for you. You may be a cross watcher, meaning you may be a Leo that is be, that is connected to a Cancerian. If you, this reading is about Leo and Cancer. Now we have a Four of Cups here showing. This is about unrequited. Um, it's an unrequited love situation. This energy, this energy is not happy. I can tell you that there. This is an energy of boredom, discontentment. They are watching you. Page of Swords. What is that showing back there? Is that the Ten of Waters? Somebody's watching. self absorbed the distraction self absorption absorption is what it says here so there could have been a missed opportunity here with a leo but now this 10 of cups that i'm seeing could be about reconciliation okay yeah this person could be dreaming about you or thinking about a new beginning or taking taking a leap towards you beginning believing they may be protecting you we have a king of swords so communication there's something this person here is seeing. Oh my God, there's definite communication coming in from this energy. Leo. Ace of Swords. There's something this energy is seeing now. Permanent energy. They could. This person is by themselves. Five of Pentacles. Someone's, this person's missing you. Did you walk away from this Leo recently, Cancer? Or this person might have walked away from something here. Eight of, eight, we have the Eight of Cups, which is a release. Five of Pentacles. So it's a lack mentality. Somebody here has a lack mentality about the situation. <clears throat> There's balance with this temperance. This person wants to reconcile with you. Because I'm seeing out the rainbow here and I just channel. I did. They thought about the Ten of Cups. Somebody here wants to reconcile with you. They, they're they they're not happy with whatever whatever's being situation they're in right now. I feel like this person's alone. Somebody here is alone. Five of Pentacles is somebody who could be missing you. This person could be missing you. Give me one more energy. Ace of Swords is communication. You have been protected. You may be seeing 444. Give me one more energy. Cancer and Leo. The world. New beginning. There's a, there's a new cycle, okay? There's a new cycle, meaning I see with the Eight of Cups and the world... A departure or some sort of release here this person has now turned their Lord they have turned their back here on something that they have completed okay whatever this is to feel like there's a balance and a reconciliation here with this energy who is missing you this person could be missing you they could have rejected you in the past it says your self-discovery um, mentorship knight of Pentacles with the moon there's something here that has taken it could have been a delay here of some kind but this is this is a message. This is a message. Page page of cups. Page of cups coming through. This could have taken a long time. That's what I'm channeling. Someone here could have taken a very long time to communicate with you. This person might have taken a while here. There's silence here between you two. They want to heal the situation. Somebody wants to mend this connection with you. Give me one more energy. Cancer and Leo. Cancer and Leo. What does cancer need to know? Something that they are completing in, indeed. There's balance here. Intuition. So they already know. Someone knows. You already know the answers you seek. The two of you, see, there's that apology. The two of you might have been on different pages at some point. And, you know, I see somebody here coming forward, expressing. Yeah, there's something here that this person is expressing. Okay. Emotions is what they're expressing in acceptance that everything happens for a reason. There's been an acceptance, an abundance. You've done the work, abundance flows to you now. So um, it's interesting because we have this lack mentality with the Five of Pentacles, and I feel like someone could feel that they're lacking of something, that there's, that there's a lack of, it could be a lack of communication could have been a lack of acceptance or abundance because now I'm seeing monetary involved so there could be a compromise that this energy is also feeling the need to do there's a compromise that somebody here needs to make 
either is to to end a cycle here of something else <clears throat> Interesting. We have five of pinnacles and that the, this you've done the work. So you've done the work. Abundance flows to you now. Accepting that things happen for a reason. I feel like it's this person now accepting that you know that why why they could have rejected this connection in the past. Because I see somebody in deep contemplation or thinking. There's a number four again. This person could be in some sort of contemplation um, of, in, of of something that something something that has to do with. Of the past a past situation yeah because now i'm seeing here past love and an apology and then longing when i see the four of cups i, I see somebody who longs for or thinks about something this person is here thinking about something look at this second chance so i see this for this energy wanting to check second chance with you cancer give me one more energy they, they they're in solitude or they could be alone what is this four of cups here for cancer Connecting with a Leo. What is this Four of Cups? I feel like this was in the past. The two of you missed. You, they feel like they missed the they missed the boat with you. We have the Hierophant. This is higher guidance that this energy is gathering now about this ending with you. We have the Ten of Swords, Ten of Pentacles, and the Nine of Cups. So see, I mentioned how a cycle, this person is completing a cycle. It could be a marriage. Okay, I'm just going to throw that out there. This energy could could be married or it could be in a commitment. Now we have the 10. Yeah, because I'm seeing the 10 of Pentacles. This could also be a commitment. Um, someone could be keeping this to themselves with a nine of cups. This may make you happy. Okay, I'm, I don't know. I'm just seeing the nine of cups here. Somebody feels happy to complete the cycle. Okay, I feel like if there's this Leo... You or this Leo are happy or somebody here is happy to come to complete a cycle and definitely um, be by themselves. That that makes sense. I feel like this person here is coming into balance, whether that is with their finances or an acceptance that they are gathering right now. See, because um, we have your abundance, you know, you've done the work, abundance flows to you now. So this person may be seeing you right now, Cancer, flourishing, meaning balanced. You may be, maybe, you see, flourishing. I'm seeing the Nine of Pentacles as meaning you're independent, financially stable. Again, somebody who's single, seeing you in the single pre-empress energy, Nine of Pentacles. This is somebody who has a confidence here, um, meaning they're financially stable. They are financially stable. Give me one second. <clears throat> My goodness. This Leo is single. Okay, look at this. Queen of Wands and the Three of Swords. If this Leo was in a commitment or some sort of situation here elsewhere with the third party, that is over. That is over and somebody's single because I'm seeing the Nine of Cups with the Nine of Pentacles. Okay? With the Nine of Pentacles. I just picked up this deck and I saw the Three of Swords with the Queen of Wands. What is this that uh, balance energy? Number 14. I Number 14, I don't know why it's resonating with me. Two of Cups. This person wants to heal this connection with you. Look, it's a Two of Cups. Le this Leo wants it with whoever. I mean, they, again, like I said, it could be a Virgo with a Leo moon. This person, but this is a Cancer and Leo reading. The Two Cups are in the Temperance. Somebody here wants to reconcile with you and, and heal this connection. Okay. I feel like this is a could be a masculine who has gained again higher guidance with the hermit and the in the higher fans is a spirituality. There's something this person here has ended recently. Okay, this Leo has ended here something recently. I just bit my tongue. I don't know why I'm sharing that with you guys. That is somebody might have done that just now. Literally just bit the tip of my tongue. <laughs> okay, so that is good confirmation. Um Thank God it wasn't too painful, but that just, I don't know what that means. I may have to like look up the meaning of that now. I just said this person has to, that's, that's confirmation. Okay. okay. Let me see. I can, I can continue. Okay. Two of them. Something they might've gone back and forth on for some time, trying to weigh out um, their options or something here. So yeah, they, this person might've been in the dark or confused. Somebody here was confused. Um, I don't know if these cards are in the reverse. Seven of Pentacles. Look, somebody's coming in. This this Leo's coming in to reconcile with you. Ten of Cups. I we saw it before. This is Leo energy. I see the Three of Wands as Leo energy. Three of Wands. This energy could be at a distance. This is an arrival, and I said it with this Knight of Pentacles. Don't tell me no. 
This person here is waiting on something. It has to do with finances, okay? It has to do with monetary because I'm seeing the Knight of Pentacles and the Seven of Pentacles. See, I'm seeing the Seven of Cups. Look at it, look at it here. Look at it here. Okay, so is this person, the, this Leo's in the Four of Cups energy. This person's unhappy. Uh, 1111 on the timing, so confirmation. I, I even bit my tongue speaking about this. Okay, so confirmation, 1111. It means that I'm telling the truth. There's a there's a person here in apathy. This is apathy, boredom, depressed. I don't know. I don't care about these people. Three of the three of cups. I don't care for these people. These women, these the other party celebration, whatever. It's not fulfilling for me. Discontentment. What did it, what does it say here? In self, this person is self up. So it's emotionally withdrawn. That's what this energy, uh, the energy that this person is in right now. You know why? You know why? Because they're thinking about this one cup, Cancer. They're thinking about their emotions for you. Didn't I say something about emotions? About an emotional message coming through from this energy. Look at the cup here. They're thinking about it. Four of cups, ace of cups, page of cups. So this Leo loves you. Okay. If you if you if you're connected to a Leo, this person is going through an acceptance right now. That everything happens for a reason. Um, that something could have definitely happened in the past with you, and boy, do they now are sitting um, just like the like just like it shows here. Look, I'm going to show the four four of cups in both decks. It's this person, they have their arms crossed. I feel like it's this energy in the nine of cups here ending. They're happy to end something. This person here is happy, happy to end the situation. With this, 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 I don't know why I was going to channel this trio. Something about trio or three people. They're happy to end this. And they're keeping this to themselves. This person might have been, you might have been in the dark confused. Or they might have left you confused. I feel like some, somebody's leaving this battle. You know, there's, a, there's an energy, which is, I feel like it's this person feeling the need here to defend themselves from this competition. Or something that kept them confined. This is a lot of strife, jealousy, fights. Look, a tower, the tower. It's a tower moment here for somebody. About a decision that, that they need to make about who to build with. Okay, Queen of Pentacles. We have um, the justice in the center. There's something about a decision this Leo is making, uh, Cancer. I feel like it has to do with other people. This person might have, might have had other people around... Um, and I feel, you know, it's interesting because I see somebody here now who's alone. Um, I feel like this person invested here in the wrong, the wrong people. And, and there, may, there may be a lack of finances right now. Somebody's awakened. This person is awakened here with this hierophant. Okay, no more confusion. No more confusion. See, I feel like this is the other options that this person, this person had in the past. And they're, you know, it just made them feel empty. Meaning confused. That was the delayed. That is why we have the Knight of the Knight of Pentacles here. Okay, the Knight of Earth. Um, so moving towards you slowly. This Leo feel I feel like this person needs to uh, complete. It's completing a cycle. It's in the midst of completing a cycle, finishing a cycle, and they do have love for you. They have a lot of love for you. This person sits by themselves and, and they think about it's emotional. The cups are emotion, emotions for you. Ace of Cups. There's a, there's a reconciliation here. If you are, if, if this reading is resonating with you, resonating with you, I'm seeing the King of Wands, Leo energy, with the Five of Cups. Look, coming forward with this emotional, emotional confession with the Knight. There, there's messages here because I'm seeing the Knight of Pentacles and the Knight of Cups. Give me one more energy. Um, what would this person would like to say to Cancer? Because you know, look, they're they're alone. They're alone, but they're gonna take a chance. This Leo's taking a chance. Oh my goodness. This person is taking a chance. Okay. Towards a wish fulfillment. And I feel like they feel like it's you. You are this person's wish fulfillment. Answering to the answering the call. Whatever the information, meaning knowledge, spiritual guidance they are receiving right now. They're going to act on. Okay. This is somebody that's going to act on um, their emotions. I feel like this is this is a Leo that is going to act on their emotions. Give me what would this person would like to say to Cancer? Cancer and Leo. 
Cancer and Leo. What would this person would like to say to Cancer? Someone's being guided. You're so smart. I feel lost without you. This person finds you intellectual, very intelligent. Um, it, you know, it stimulates, I mean, it turns them on in some way. I really enjoy our conversations. So um, this is a game. This person might have been playing games with you, okay? Five of, five of Swords. Somebody might have been doing something just to get your attention. We have here Lost. I feel lost without you. That is a Four of Cups, okay? Discontent and boredom. The way I'm acting, responding, or posting. Perhaps, you know, they made you feel like they, they really didn't care. This is somebody who made you feel like they didn't care. Give me one more energy. What else would this energy would like to say to Cancer? Unclear. That is a Seven of Cups. They don't know where they stand with you. This energy doesn't know where they stand with you. They may be unclear with themselves, okay? You feel like home. You feel like home. You know, I, I talked about a second chance and an apology. I mean, so here it is. That's a page of cups, ace of cups, and the two of cups. You can expect the apology um, that you want to hear from this person, okay? That, that's, that is what the knight of cups is. You can expect the apology you want to hear. See, this is them taking a chance. Okay, this person may be nervous. They may be nervous here to take a chance. Missing you. Somebody's missing you. This Leo is missing you, I should say. Give me one more energy. Unblock me. It says here, I miss you. Again. Unblock me. I miss you and want to connect. So, others' opinions. I just saw missing you again. Others' opinions. That was a three of cups. The other people this, this energy um, might have been um, associated with, they're, they're letting them go. Look, let the past go. This person's letting these, this bird, whoever this, these surrounded people that they were involved with, whether this was a commitment or other friends or people or just situations in their life, okay? Cultures, families, families, friends, beliefs. I'm working towards breaking free from limiting myself based on, on the beliefs of others. Okay, that is what this person is saying. We have obsession and they are letting this go. There's somebody that is letting the past go. Give me one more energy, Leo and Cancer. Emotional intimacy. I am afraid to truly open up to you. Being raw and authentic with my emotions is something that I'm working on. So somebody's working on expressing this, coming forward with emotions, okay? So they are, the, at least this person, you know, there's a sense of self-awareness, okay, with uh, this energy. See, intuition, as I said that. Someone that could have been on different pages with you. Let's get one of these two in the reading, Cancer. I feel somebody here taking a chance towards you, okay? Taking a chance towards something that feels like a wish fulfillment. I feel like it's you. It's you. Finances. I feel like finances right now, if you are connecting to this person, okay? Um, maybe, an, maybe an issue for this person right now. Healing family issues could be also. We were just speaking of that. Families. Okay, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So give me one more energy, Cancer and Leo. Cancer connecting to a Leo. The sign of Leo. I wanted to show. Trust. There's a need now to trust. The situation is calling for you to have faith. We have the Hierophant there and that, that is higher guidance. Somebody um, is trusting right now. See, we have intuition. You already know the answers you seek. So this person might have been dreaming about you recently, or you may be dreaming of them as well. So letting go of control issues, that is what somebody here is doing. They may, they may have a, some sort of uh, support system or somebody that is, that, that's helping them. Or you know what? This may just be the group of people, of friends that they had that were deceptive around them. Because so we have letting your friends help you and we have deception. Someone might have been receiving bad advice from their friends. That is why this has, uh, we have allow the situation to unfold naturally. So this is a, a person that could have been listening to their families or their friends. Okay, now there's a need now to, that, that I, I channeled that message. I channeled that message. This is why somebody here was so confused. This Leo could have been confused or you could have been confused. See, separation. They're freeing themselves. This energy is freeing themselves from some sort of illusion here or other people. And they're going to come towards you apologizing. Give me one more energy. Whether you accept their apology or not, Cancer, okay, we, we all have free will, okay? This is a soulmate. This is a soulmate. In this 
is that four of cups that we continue to see in this reading. There's an unrequited love situation here. There could have been an unrequited love situation with this person in the past. However, this could also be them having an unrequited, have had, having had an unrequited love situation elsewhere. Okay, there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. So I feel like this person, um, didn't I channel that? They're letting go of somebody else. There's an unrequited love situation here. And that is why somebody here is in this ap ap apathy energy, a discontentment, withdrawn, emotionally withdrawn. This person's not attracted to whoever they're, they're, they're letting go of control issues. Someone here might have chosen a partner here because they felt that it was to, because of family approval, okay, or the approval of their friends or family, something like that. This is somebody whom you are in separation from. Letting go of control issues. Look at how this masculine is looking at these people. It's like, do you see the indifference in this person's face? It's like he, they're, it, allow the situation to unfold naturally. It's like this person now looking at their friends and their families like they're crazy. See, like they're deceptive. I just saw 222, like 2202 on the timing. So confirmation. This is why there's a need here to let these people go and come to, there's something here that they need. They feel like they need to come forward towards, um, you know, take a leap, take, take a leap and come come forward towards a, something that they, they want, something that feels genuine to them, a wish fulfillment. Someone's going to take a leap towards a wish fulfillment. Stay optimistic. That is the full energy. Stay optimistic about your love life because you do deserve love. Okay, you are lovable. You are lovable. I said something about finances and career. Okay, with a five of pentacles, well, here it is. This person's paying attention to, somebody's paying attention to red flags right now. Okay, if they were in a commitment, I feel like their spouse could have been taking money or maybe they're, maybe they're, they're shopaholic or they only care about the material, something like that. Financial issues are a factor in your love life. So the signs are cautioning this person, pay atten paying attention to the red flags. It's what somebody's doing here. So you look, this person here is walking away from, from something to say, a, a marriage or commitment that felt deceptive uh, to them. And they're happy to do so. This this Leo is happy to do so. Um, this if, if this person's not married, okay, um, I feel like somebody might have been trying to trick somebody to marry them or maybe trying and, and now, now, now somebody it's not going to attentions of others. There's, there's other people here involved. I feel like there's family involved, there's friends involved trying to make somebody do something that they don't want to do, okay? Someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship, and that is what your person is realizing. This this person is missing you. There's missing, there's somebody here is missing you, and they, you know, they keep they keep it to themselves. They keep this to themselves. So you see the smirk on this energy's face, on the Nine of Cups? This energy keeps it to themselves. There were family here and friends involved here to try to make somebody here do something that they didn't want to do. Divine timing is at play, I can tell you that. Let let everything unfold in divine timing. Okay? So I see I see somebody here releasing, meaning breaking free out of a situation. We saw it with the Ten of Swords and the Ten of Pentacles. It could be family cancer. It could be family. Let's get one of these to end the reading. Let me shuffle this deck. <clears throat> I have divine feminine at the bottom of the deck. Give me one more energy for Leo and Cancer. What you need to know from this reading is that this Leo is not happy or somebody, this person is certainly not happy um, in the situation that they're in. And they're, they're looking at their pe the people around them right now like they're completely out of their mind. <laughs> and there, there's a need here to allow, allow your spirit guides to guide you. Then somewhat, someone may, I feel like there's a sense of also assistance and protection in this situation. This person's being guided. Okay, somebody's being guided here. See, from this illusion. From this illusion, this is Neptune energy. From this fantasy, from this codependency, and they're trusting. So you see, there's a need to trust now. This person's trusting in, in the, the signs and the messages that they are receiving right now. Give me one more energy for this reading, Cancer and Leo. Cancer and Leo. And they're alone. This energy is alone. Yeah, they, they could have been resistant. This is comfort zone. Fear of the new, clinging to old ways and situations. Someone here was fearful here to, to distance themselves from, from their, the, the family circle or the, pe the, the people that they, they hang around with. 
you know, it could have affected their finances. If this energy here decided to make a change and leave something behind, it could have very, very well so affected their finances. If you are connecting to a Leo or whoever has Leo in their chart, there's something that's happening here around the fall, or this is a timing card. The past is over. This person wants to start over with you. See, clear. They want to clear the past and make new, new intentions is what it says here. So could be around the fall, could be around, could, could be around the fall. Watching, communication, mercury energy. My voice is going out, so <clears throat> there's something here. I just I just mentioned communication with Mercury. Um, so there's something here this person needs to say to a divine feminine, which could be you. This is a Leo feminine energy. So there it is, this, this feminine energy showing. Intuitive, nurturing, creative. This energy may view you in this energy. Look at this union. Union. This is where I'm going to leave the reading. Okay, we have soulmate energy, and this is a lover's card. You have a soulmate connection here with this energy. Something is going to happen here around October, September. Could be, yeah, end of, yeah, end of September, October, November, November. Channeling September, I don't know why. September is calling at me. Give me one more energy, and I said I was going to leave the reading here. Soulmate energy. Okay, there we go. Four of Wands. Four of Wands, Union. Family, foundation, commitment, home, four of wands, marriage, celebration, and security. Okay? The ace of cups. Don't tell me no, Cancer. If your person has Leo in their chart, this person loves you. They love you. This is the second second time we see this in the reading. It does say healing in this card. So romantic offer, a renewal. There's, there's definitely a renewal. Emotions and new love. There's emotions being expressed to you from this energy. Okay? There is emotions and something here they want to do. The Four of Wands is 11-11 confirmation, but it's a union. It's two people coming together. Cancer, I hope you enjoyed this reading. Let me know if you did in the comment section. I am sending you all so much love and light. I love you guys. This is the setup for now. I will change it up as, as I go. As you guys know, if you've been watching me, this is how I do my readings. Okay, I just move around quite a bit. And um, yeah, so I'll be back soon. Until next reading, Cancer, namaste.